new tonight, the longtime ride-sharing service, Super Shuttle, will be out of business come New Year's Day. Yeah, this is leaving people with disabilities few, if any, options for a ride over to the airport. Team 12's Bram Resnick spoke to a leading disability advocate and a longtime Super Shuttle user. And Bram, this rider is shocked to hear this news, right? Uh, that's right. Phil Pancrazio can't just hop into an Uber or a Lyft like most of us to catch a flight to the airport. Even a friend's car won't do. And now he has no idea how we'll get to Sky Harbor after Super Shuttle shuts down. Wow, that's that's really disappointing. Phil Pancrazio's job often takes him out of town. He's been using Super Shuttle to Sky Harbor Airport for 20 years. I have no idea who I would use now. USA Today reports that airports around the country were told this week that Super Shuttle will go out of business on December 31st. State Representative Jennifer Longden got a taste of life without Super Shuttle on Friday. Looks like maybe they're already checking out, she tweeted from Washington, D.C. Super Shuttle didn't pick me up at my hotel today to take me back to the airport. Three hours later, I'm still sitting here trying to get a ride. I'm going to have to spend some time once I'm home figuring out what transportation is going to look at look like for future flights and that's something the average typically able person doesn't have to do. Pancrazio says thousands of people need a wheelchair accessible vehicle when they travel. You can't put a power wheelchair into someone's automobile, a friend's automobile. That's not really possible. Uber and Lyft don't have wheelchair accessible vehicles in the valley. Some cab companies do, but they'll charge 25 bucks extra for the ride. And that could leave countless wheelchair users grounded. I don't even know who, who the other providers are out there. And State Representative Jennifer Longden did make it to her airport gate in Washington with a lot of help and with just five minutes to spare.